Vasa. Yeah, the, the first woman whose cancer I c helped uh, cure, she cured it. I mean, but I, I cured it because I cured it with it. I mean, I, I was the one who told her what to do, but she was the one who did it. So I cured her cancer, and also she cured her cancer. And that was Edith, and she died of a heart attack. About, but it was about five years later. She married. She remarried, and everything. Her life went. She had a great life. You know. That's why she and I stopped talking. Because she didn't need me anymore. She had a great life. Everything was working for her. So you know, I mean, we probably touched base a few times, but I didn't know then what I know now. Okay. And that's why she's dead. See, she could still be alive. She would be, yeah, but how? she yeah. was 67, right, right. she'd be 85. Now, she would be, she'd be 85 or 86 now. But the, back then, was there any way of knowing that, um, she, that there was um, a heart attack about to happen? Was there any yes, to um, I want you to test this question. Do I have heart disease? Do I have heart disease? In any of my bodies. In any of my bodies. Um, I'm not too sure there. Let's, te well, let, let's just go on and test another disease. Do okay. I have HIV in any of my bodies? Do I have HIV in any of my bodies? I'm getting a signal. Okay, now um, <clears throat> you would want to test through each body. I mean, you know how to do that now, so we don't have to do that. Yeah, right? I do. You're gonna after we get off the phone, you will be HIV free. Because <laughs> okay. you've never been you've never been diagnosed with HIV. You have never. you have no medical case of HIV, but you just found HIV. Yeah. See, you will find it where the doctor can't. Okay. The doctor can't detect it, but you can. Now that doesn't mean you actually infected yourself by, you know, having sex with an infected partner. It just means that it's in your gravitational body, which could cause you to attract an infected partner. Oh, okay. And then you would get it physically. For example, let me give you another example. Test this. Do I have tuberculosis in any of my bodies? Do I have tuberculosis in my body? Yeah, getting a signal there. Okay, again, that you would have to probably live in a country where tuberculosis was going around. But if you were in that situation, you might find that you attracted the disease where others weren't getting it. But, but after we get off the phone, you're going to remove tuberculosis from all your bodies. Okay, and HIV. And HIV, and we don't have to go back to the heart disease because now you know that you're supposed to check for all these diseases. Okay. Mm -hmm. And, you know, check, check for them for a long time. Once you find a disease, you're supposed to check for it. And, and if you hear about a new disease, that you, you know, never heard of, you want to check yourself for it. Right. Okay? And I'll tell you a little story. I actually, you know, I live in a place where there's a lot of mosquitoes. Yeah. I live in, yeah. I, I go out into a, into a park and there's like swarms of mosquitoes there sometimes. I mean, it's a wildlife preserve. I, it's about a block from my house. And uh, I got West Nile virus and I cured it. Now, I can't prove that. I mean, I, I, I've never, you know, worn a... T I haven't given myself credit for curing it because a doctor didn't diagnose me with it. See, I cured herpes. I had two kinds of herpes, which is another incurable virus. And I cured that, you know. But I never... I didn't write on my credits that I have... I cured West Nile virus. But I was getting the symptoms. Yeah. And I took it out and it went away. It was gone, you know.
but I was getting the symptoms of it. And this, it, it was like the most serious virus I ever got. It was like mo it was a monster. I, re I really said, man, I understand why people die of this. Gosh. Because it was really a, it was major, you know. But I just See took what, I just think? cured it. I just took it out and it went away. And it took me about you know about an hour. It was gone. All right. But it probably took me a day and a half to contract. You know, I was I was letting it run. I you know a lot of times don't you find that you're you're just you slack off and you don't cure things when you should. Yeah, like um, yesterday when I went out, um, I didn't cover my neck with a scarf because it's very cold out here now. And um, I came back and now my voice is very croaky, um, you know. And I'm thinking, well, you know, how do I go about curing this? Yeah. You know, right. I wasn't sure what words to use. Uh huh. Yeah, like, you know, how do I, you know, I'm now removing my, um, this, uh, I don't even know what to call it, a croaky throat from my whatever bodies. I wasn't sure how to yeah. phrase it. Yeah. And what happened? Did you, did you cure it finally? No, um, well, it's eased up now. It's not too bad, but I still need to do something about it. And I'm not too sure what words to use. Okay, well, see, the thing is that <clears throat> you are still not, um, you're not in the, in the habit of using our web college. And, okay. and you haven't used it enough to understand how to use it. Like, for example, um, where would you think to look for flu? Is it flu that I have? I was okay. Do you test that you had a, maybe you didn't have a flu, but still you could probably use the, oh, sa the same procedure you would use for a flu on that, what you did have. Right, okay. Okay, t uh, t um, where would you look? Well, I would go into the hub. Yeah. And, um, oh, I can't remember, you know, up the top, uh, right at the top you have like um, A to Z. And if I press F for flu, um, or yeah, I'll just press the letter F, then obviously scroll down. And no, the actually there is no A to Z at the top of the hub. Say it again? There is no A to Z at the top of the hub. Okay, well, I know I will go into the hub way. Yeah, see, that's the thing. I'm, I'm telling you again go into that you skills. do not, you have not accustomed yourself to using the web college. You're just going to have to use it a lot more. There's, there's, okay. no, there's no way around it. You're going you're gonna to have to spend hours at first. You have to do this all day. You're going to have to spend hours just surfing. Like, let me show you something um, on this. Can you see my screen? Are you looking at your own face? Um, there's a big screen at the top. Hang on. The window. Okay, here we are. There you are now. You okay, see, yeah. See yourself? Okay. This is the one with the A to Z. It's the list of lessons. Okay, lessons. That's the Okay, if you click on flu, you won't get anything. We can save ourselves the trouble. So I'm going to go to the hub, and you can see there is no A to Z on the hub. But what there is right here is remove viruses, right above your picture. So you could use that. Now also, up here is Cure Show. That, this is the Cure Show. Okay. <laughs> and as you can see, there is an A to Z here, right? Okay, yeah. And you click on F, and we go, if we go down through the Fs, we get Flu. Now, it's just a link. Flu is a separate page. And here we are on the flu hotline. And there are all these people curing flu on the flu hotline. There's about 25, there's about, well, whatever, there's a lot of them. There's a whole, a whole line of names of people curing flu and related things like the cold you had. Okay. 
So that's an example. If you look around, you need to train yourself to look around. And then you will find what you need. Right. Okay. You can cure anything. There, and there's a lesson on it probably here. <laughs> You'll find a lesson. It's somewhere or other. You will find a lesson. Sure. Area code eight one three six seven two three four one nine. Ta da ta da ta da.